In football, there are rough patches where we just can't seem to catch a pass or we are unable to catch a pass. In this video, we will further explain how to get out of a slump in football. Yeah, what's up YouTube? It's Scotty Sports Performance with another YouTube video for today. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our Facebook page at Scotty Sports Performance and our blog, which the URL will be in the, the description. Three aspects that can help you get out of a slump or being able to realize this is a slump. Understanding that you have to keep going at your game and understanding that a new day presents new opportunities. The first aspect to getting out of a slump is understanding that you're in a slump. In order to get out of a slump, it's to understand what a slump is. A slump is described as a period when a player or team is not performing well or up to expectation. These slumps can last for long periods of time, from a period in your sport to a half of the season. Noticing these slumps are big because eventually they'll affect your confidence, your skill, and even your mindset towards the game. Okay, now that you know what a slump is, how can we get out of it? The second aspect is to keep training at your skill. The only thing you can truly control is your work that you put in and the things that you can do. You must attack practice with the same, maybe even more ferocity than you did before. This is important because you, to make sure everything is going right, you have to practice the movement. Now I will say that your mindset into practicing can't be too vengeful because if you risk the you risk the chance of being overly mad in practice and having another poor performance so remember to attack it and be focused to see everything through and get out of that phone the last aspect is understanding that yesterday is simply that yesterday like dude we get it you dropped multiple passes and you keep fumbling and making mistakes but what are you going to do about yesterday? You have to let go of that performance and accept that they caught you slipping. Being able to put the bad performance behind you helps with going forward because you have no reason to think about the bad performance and everything to think about when it's time to ball out. So simply identify it's a slump, work hard to get out of it, and put the past behind you. These simple steps You'll be killing it in no time, and that slump will be nothing. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our Facebook page at Scotty Sports Performance. And also check out our blog, which the description will be in the description box underneath the video. But also, please, can you comment, comment, like, and also share your thoughts under, under the video. We would like to have more different ideas and hear what you guys have to say about the video. But until then, peace.